Today our plan for Minecraft is we're going to get some enchantments going. We're going to try and get some, maybe some more netherite. Get us some good gear. Get us some good, you know, stuff going on here. And then uh, maybe take on that bastion we found and get some loot from that. Or uh, at least we want to do some other stuff. Anyway, I left off here at the, uh, boop -a -boop, the spawner area. So basically I was just sitting here uh, while I was doing other things, watching streams, playing cyberpunk actually, while I was uh, waiting for this. I'd have this open in one window playing cyberpunk in the other, just standing here, just waiting. Also, my hostile mob sounds are turned off. <laughs> I didn't want to get the rah stuff going. But so I was just standing here, waiting for the, the zomboys to pile up so I could just destroy them as they uh, grouped up like this. And I got to 42 levels. I think the last time we were at, was it like 28 or something? We should have enough to enchant at least a couple of things, add some mending onto some stuff. I'm just going to kind of wait for a couple more boys to fall down here. There we go. So I can kind of show you what. Yeah, so. Let's get to 43 here. So basically, I would just like ignore the stream for, or ignore uh, Minecraft for like 10, 20 minutes. Wait for them to pile up, swing the sword a couple of times, and get like a bunch of uh, experience going. It was nice, and then, of course, I muted it because of all the uh, uh, stuff going on here. But anyway, we also got uh, all this loot here. We can take this rotten flesh back to uh, actually, goddamn, I might just take this helmet. <laughs> we got all this rotten flesh we can trade to a cleric. We got some iron, some carrots, we got a feather, we got a efficiency shovel. Goddamn. I'm gonna take the stuff and then maybe can, like, what does my current chest piece do? I can't, I guess, enchant my current chest piece with that one. Nevertheless, so we got fire protection, respiration, and unbreaking on that helmet. It's not bad. How's it going, Shadow? Welcome to the stream, my dude. A lucky find. All right, let's just slay these zombies. Is experience getting stuck? Doesn't look like it. Yeah, a lot of loot in here just from the uh, zombie killing that we've been doing. It's a shame you can't, like, convert uh, leather armor into stuff. I think you can smelt down... Uh, I think that zombie died from fall damage, actually. That one right there. Why did I get cobble? Did they drop cobble? Huh? Anyway, uh, let's just wear this one. Fire protection will come in handy a little bit. Got the protection four on that. So we just need to enchant our chest, our booties, then we can save this chest piece for actually nothing. Because if we die, we uh, we die for good. All right, one more zombie ought to do it. Once he drops down, we can just knock him in the face. And we'll have uh, 43 levels. We can go back home, start enchanting some gear. I don't know why there's a raw chicken here. Do zombies drop raw chicken? That seems weird. Also, there's a feather. Did a chicken somehow spawn in here and die? Ah, come on. Well, we're just like a smidge away from leveling up, so we can get that at another place. We can actually just mine like one coal. Two coal? Three, maybe? Okay. Making me look bad now. Actually, is coal not enough to level you up? <laughs> or out... <clears throat> outpace the mending, maybe? There we go. Okay. Place the torch. I think part of the problem might be there's too many zombies, like... Yeah. Might be spawning outside the bounds. Not a problem, Blackjack. Just glad you kind of came by, that's all. Enjoy the rest of your day if you're leaving early. <clears throat> anyway, let's go home. We'll see if we can find uh, some good enchantments. So we got to do our sword, our 
boots, possibly our helmet and our chest piece. So, all that. Yeah. Oh yeah, up further. Not bad. I always forget about it. We can also trade all of our rotten flesh to the uh, cleric and get some good... It's just made it seem really bright out right now. Like, the sand looks way brighter than usual. My god. Okay. Real quick, hold up. Alright. Yeah. Mosey on home. You know, in hindsight, it may have been a better idea to build an enchantment table out near the uh, spawner so we don't have to go back home just to enchant stuff. But, you know, whatever. I should go sometimes. Uh, so I've decided my overall goal I want to kill the Ender Dragon, but I also want to explore around a lot. So we're going to kill the Ender Dragon at some point. Not maybe, Probably not today. Um, kill him. We're going to get some Shulker Chests. And I'm just going to, like, journey around. I really want to, like, just find some cool stuff. Like a Woodland Mansion that I've never seen before. I want to get one of those. And all that good jazz. But I really want the Elytra so we can uh, move around a lot faster. Anyway, what are our Scholar materials for right now? Rotten Flash. Um, I'm going to store this here. Need a new chest for cobble. Um, what is a barrel? Not a barrel. What, what is it called? It's, uh, it's called a barrel, right? Is it not? Am I dumb? Hold on. Maybe because I need these as well. Yeah, okay. What I thought. I'm gonna grab a couple of barrels. Just, uh... Oh, right. Okay, barrels are dumb. <clears throat> Put them up here, though. There we go. All right. I'm gonna store all my cobblestone in one of these barrels. This cobblestone takes up a lot of, uh... I was gonna say a lot of space, but actually it does not appear to actually take up a lot of space, because I only have one stack of it there. Two stacks. Anyway, I can store dirt in there, too. Other one's dirt. I said the other one's dirt. There we go. So I can use sand for this one. There we go. Store all that. All right. All yeah, right, good. All right, let's go trade to our cleric friend real quick. Some uh, the rotten flesh out of our inventory. Here. Come here, cleric. I forget what else they do. Actually, before I sell those, let's let them level up. Ooh, I can give him gold now, too? Perfect. Quite, uh, actually, would it be better to trade him gold, or would it be better to give the piglins gold? Probably better for the piglins, right? Anyway, we got 15 emeralds just from the, uh, trades of the Rotten Flesh. Not, not bad, so we got a total of that many emeralds. Hell yeah, that's enough for a protection book. I'm actually gonna take those with me while we, uh, enchant our gear here. So let's get this stuff off. So I can see what we're doing here. Grab a book. Lapis. All right. Chest pieces first. What do we got? Fire protection. Do not want that on my chest piece. Sword. We got unbreaking three. Do not want that. Boots. We got protection three. Okay, I can do that. What about the helmet? Blast protection. Don't really need blast protection. Um, what about my crossbow? Piercing, okay. Piercing just goes through enemies, I think. Um, well, I guess protection on my boots wouldn't be bad to have. And Depth Strider, heck yeah, we're 
able to, isn't Death Strider like quickly moving underwater or something? I forgot what it is exactly. All right, chest piece. Protection, okay. Sword, sharpness, okay. Helmet, protection three, okay. All right, so it's a toss up between the another right chest piece or the sword. All right, RNG, let's go. Yeah. Oh, yeah, protection on unbreaking. Yeah, that'll work. All right, very nice. All right, next, sharpness on the sword. Ooh, looting. I'll take that. Just looting, no sharpness. Okay. That's fair. And then what about the helmet here? What do we got here? Protection four. Ooh. I might take that over the. Uh, other diamond helmet. I can always... Uh, can't really find them, actually. But let's go ahead and do that. Fresh nano breaking, okay. I can combine those together to make something new. And then piercing four for my crossbow. Heck yeah. All right. All right, so that's everything fully enchanted. I just need to get a, an actual axe, and we will be better set up. But first... Before we do anything else, let's get my mending book and we will go ahead and All right, let's go with the another right chest piece. We're going to throw mending on that. There we go. And then if I combine these, it gives me fire protection three and a breaking three. Okay. But if I reverse them, it's going to give me protection. Hmm. What do I have my pantaloons? I've got unbreaking four. Okay. So do I want protection or fire protection? I mean, I guess I'm going to take protection because it's more than the fire protection too. So we're just going to do that. And uh, that one. Perfect. All right. We're all geared out. We got unbreaking on everything except for the boots. We've got protection on everything. Everything's protection three or higher, which is great. Um, our sword needs mending, our boots need mending, and our helmet needs mending. Everything else should be good. Okay, so let's real quick, I need to put some stuff back up here. I think we got enough for a couple of mending books. Let me just grab yeah, I got paper here. Okay. Make a couple more books. That way we can trade for some more mending. Eh, let's sleep real quick. All right. So we shall make a couple more mending books just to get our sword and our armor mended up. That way nothing, you know, breaks on us. Because that would be most unfortunate. We also need to feed our chickens and grab this experience that's on the ground here. Oh, yeah. Give me that trade experience, baby. All right, Mending Villager. I require a couple of Mending books from you. Thank you kindly. All right, so that's two I can get Mending on my helmet and boots. I need one more for my sword, and then we'd be good. All right. Well, let's... See if I can feed some of the, the chicky poos over here. Also, now that I have looting, I can get a lot more meat and leather from the, uh, the cows. That'll be good. So let's just go over to our wheat farm. And we're just gonna... Meow. Okay. That, and we'll just replant. And we'll start breeding our chickens so we can get some more feathers and arrows and stuff. And we'll also breed our cows and our sheep, because why not? Okay. Alright, let us do another row. Oops. 
Maybe I get like, uh, I don't know. I might just adjust that later. How the uh, lights work. I don't like hitting the torches every time. Okay. Do, 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 do. All right. Grab all the wheat. Perfect. One more pass. I was gonna grab some pumpkins to trade. Also need some more melon as well. I will grab that as well. I think I need like four more. What was the number, right? For the emeralds? I think it's 14. I have 10. Yeah. I was going to do this row, then we'll go back. Perfect. Okay. Look at all the sheep and pigs that are just kind of out of their damn pens. This is unacceptable. Shit. Okay. Why is my FPS low? Where is video settings? We'll just turn the render distancing down a little bit. That way it'll give us a couple extra FPS. Okay. All right, cows, come get your food. Here you go, a little for you, a little for you. Keep breeding, keep making them cow calves. We are. Come on. Eat up. Okay. Sheep! Okay. Sheep are all pretty much bred. Still a cat in there, along with the golem. Ugh. Eh, okay. Hot right, chicks. Here you go. It's gonna be such a uh, a pain to do. I'm gonna save those. We'll dump the rest of the seeds into our fertilizer. Hello, villager. I would like your emeralds, please. Hmm. Store some of the extra melon there, and we'll store pumpkins. Goddamn sheep, stop jumping over the walls! I'm gonna store all that there, okay. Alright, let's go get our next mending book for our sword. Still need one for the crossbow, but that'll, that'll come later. Vill villager, hello. I require your services. Okay, excellent. Now, we got all we need. What were the other villagers? What did, what did they have? He had a protection four, and he has a fortune two, which doesn't matter because we already have fortune three now. So, really, all we need is a sharpness and a uh, unbreaking book for our uh, our diamond sword here, and we're we're pretty much golden. So. All that. Store these there. Okay. Uh, take this stuff off quick. Right? Okay. Boots and mending. Helmet and mending. Sword and mending. Perfect. There we go. Okay. Yes, sir, Bob. We are fully decked out now. More or less, there's still a lot to improve upon 
in terms of our uh, our gear. Do I have torches crafted anywhere? Oh, I got some extra arrows. Hell yeah. I will take those with me. Okay. We got our golden helmet. We got protection four on that. I'm breaking on that. Respiration on that so I can breathe underwater a little bit better. We've got mending, unbreaking, and protection on that. Pretty much a full set there. Protection, unbreaking, depth strider, protection, and mending. That could use unbreaking, but other than that, it's pretty fine. Doesn't really matter since it has mending on it anyway. But ideally, well, I mean, yeah, I guess since it's always going to be on me, it's always going to repair when I get experience. So it should be fine. Especially once we get netherite, it's going to last a long time. Uh, unbreaking could be used on the shield. And then for the diamond sword, we just need sharpness and then unbreaking and looting two again so we can get a, uh, a looting three sword, which will mean we'll get a lot of good stuff. Okay. And then the pickaxe, uh, efficiency five is what that maxes out to. Other than that, it would be good. And then he's looting on that to get a bunch of flint. Okay. All right. How are we looking? We got food. We've got our hoe for stuff in the nether. I think we're geared. I don't need this axe. Well, I'm going to keep the axe, but... Let me get... I'll just take a couple of blocks with me here. We have something to build with. Uh, let me give me that. I'll stack more. There we go. Okay. All right. We're going to go back in the nether. We're going to try and loot that bastion and hopefully not die. Because even with like a uh, full suit of diamond armor on my friend's world, I still ran into the brutes and was like, yep, I'm going to just back the fuck up out of here. But we'll give it a shot. If we can't do a whole lot against them, we will possibly uh, decide to try and find more netherite. Now... We'll test our might. I'd be a lot more confident if I had a sharpness sword as opposed to a, uh, a normie sword like this. Looting's good and all, but uh, sharpness would be a lot better. Okay. I'm just gonna eat my uh, melon. There's a brute. Son of a bitch. Okay. God, I hate this. Okay. We just gotta, uh... Gotta survive. Just gotta survive, that's all. Actually, I might, uh... I might put on my golden helmet. Just uh, so they don't come over and decide to nom on me uh, if I'm just walking around nonchalantly. There was a hoglin. That's right, that's what they're called, hoglins. I forgot for a second. Okay. Let's uh, cross over this. A lot of levels here. I see a guy with a crossbow down there. Or she's got enchantments on it. What if I go up this way? Yep, that's about what I thought was going to happen there. Okay. Oh, boy. Oh, well, there's a lantern down there. Lantern up here. Oh, boy. If this wasn't hardcore, I would be a lot more... Uh... So these guys will... Uh... God, so many hits. Oh, fuck. We gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go. Oh, no. We're dead. Yep. Okay. Well, good game. Good game. We died. Back to the title screen. Uh, well, that sucks. 
spent so much time leveling up and like getting stuff, having an old fashioned good old time and just destroyed. Oh man. Such a shame. All those enchantments and everything could not stop the Piglin army that decided to just roll on us. Fuck. Well, I suppose that does it for, uh, for that segment there. I'll just go ahead and uh, end this recording for YouTube so that uh, we can end the, uh, the, the hardcore one here. We're going to continue with some stuff here, but for now, I'll just, uh, I'll just end that. Yay. Thank y'all for watching. Bye.